invited select students to work on their New Year's resolution, uh, anywhere from uh, doing 20 push-ups to uh, being involved with international organizations. Now, what, what is your resolution? Are you taking the steps to start the resolution? As all the students met each other and were able to um, learn more specifics about the project, meet each other, learn about their own resolutions and share them, and they were it was a really exciting time. My New Year's resolution is to be more involved in the international organizations at UNT. I want to be able to learn from other cultures and countries and uh, be able to share what I know. So a little bit about myself. I'm a military veteran. I got out of the Navy in February of uh, 2011. By being involved in the organizations, I think it'd be a great opportunity for me to learn more about what's out there in the world. My New Year's resolution this year is to do 20 push-ups a day. I really like working out and push-ups have always been harder for me to do, so I just wanted to kind of start small. Just my status right now, I am, I can do about eight to 10 consecutive push-ups and that's good push-up, 90 degree angle not on my knees, I don't do the girly push-up. My New Year's resolution is not necessarily one thing so much as um, I've decided to quit smoking and in turn have decided to live a healthier um, lifestyle. Whatever I feel is helping me now, I just need to continue it, which is changing my habits, changing my dietary habits, changing my health habits. My resolution is to obtain complete self-love and acceptance. I think as all my other resolutions were like, I'm gonna lose, so much weight, and blah, 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 you know. And I realized that I didn't really necessarily love myself, and I've always had really terrible self-esteem. I guess the steps that I'm taking now are doing my best not to be so hard on myself, but it's really hard sometimes, especially because I've been so used to it. My New Year's resolution is to stop procrastinating. I chose procrastination because I've been procrastinating since I was like in high school. But in college, in being a double major, it, it's much more difficult. Well, I tried to devote um, a lot of time last weekend to, you know, making up for a lot of the work that I, you know, was, it's not even work really, it's just like a lot of reading. It's been a little difficult because it's like once you start procrastinating, you just have to do so much to get caught up. And my New Year's resolution is to become a peer mentor. I've experienced a lot of things when I speak to different kids, like at high school. I was like, well, maybe I can, you know, help them or be a guide towards them, help guide them in the right path. The first step that I actually took was um, completing the evaluation of myself, doing experiences, uh, things I have accomplished, my goals, my dreams, just so I can find some common ground that will relate to me. My resolution is kind of a unique one. It's, I want to quit having sex until I'm in a fully committed relationship. Well, I was kind of getting in this cycle of using physical relationships as a way to fill an emotional void. And it wasn't like very vicious or anything, but I could just see myself going down the path I saw my friends going through. And I just didn't want that to happen. I want a committed relationship. I want love. I want the next girl I'm with to be the girl that I'm going to marry. I was a vegetarian for six years, and at some point I realized that eating dairy products was just as bad, I guess, for animals as eating steak would be. I've noticed, um, just in the past few weeks, I feel a lot healthier. The New Year's resolution I chose was to get involved. So I've been here since 2008, and I've tried to get involved with different stuff, but I never had the time to be dedicated to one organization. So I'm like, I'm almost done. I want to get involved and, you know, enjoy college while I still can.
I have actually joined an organization on campus. I'm really excited. Um, it's called UNT Live. One of my friends actually started this organization a couple months ago. And um, so I've joined his organization and he has asked me to be the secretary. Excited about having made it this far and really surprised at myself for how dedicated I am and committed. It's definitely been, you know, definitely helping with the confidence, uh, being more social, just being more comfortable talking, expressing my feelings as far as when it comes to relationships. I haven't gotten to 20 yet. Um, this past week I got all the way to 15 though. So. I think probably the biggest thing is, I think it's better to focus on being a good person. If someone has a genuine goodness and light to them, that's gonna shine through 10 times more than anything else on the outside. I think that because my resolution was so drastic, like totally cutting out a part of my diet, um, I think that I'm probably gonna stick with it for a while. The past week, like I've just come to the realization like I can't really stress over what has already happened because it's already happened and it's done. I can just, you know, learn from that and move forward. In regard to um, talking to my mentees, um, I realized not to be so um, self-centered and self-minded within myself. I've learned a lot like related to the the pro or the uh, news resolution and not like I like I was saying I'm, I'm learning how the organizations work, how many there are. I didn't realize there's so many programs and stuff out there. Even if it's not an actual organization, there's a lot of uh, you know like group meetups and stuff in Denton and stuff like that. There are lots of services that are offered by the Division of Student Affairs and there's also services that are offered outside of our division. Um, student Services PEs mostly pay for the things that happen in Student Affairs and so this project was kind of an effort to let students know um, the sort of services that are offered to them that maybe they don't know about already or they have known about but just finally it was a way for them to start using them because they had a particular resolution that they wanted to meet and those services possibly could help them get there.